What was that? In a world where nobody follows any rules, this is Streptococcus pneumonia. A more accurate picture of this would look like this. These guys are bad. They're out to get you. We are discussing right now. There can be several outcomes, including death, depending upon several factors. Here, we will only discuss the process of infection uh, and assume uh, complete healing through the process of resolution. Resolution means uh, complete uh, clearing of mess created by bacteria and return of lung to normal function. Infection starts uh, when bacteria make their way to alveoli of lungs. Alveoli always have uh, macrophages which start uh, phagocytosis, means they start killing the bacteria and if they completely finish the bacterial population that has managed to enter in alveoli of lung, then nothing goes wrong and process finishes. In case if macrophages cannot kill the whole population, then the rest of the bacteria start damaging the host cell, the alveolar cells, by releasing toxins. Hemolysin is a toxin that is produced by uh, and, and released by some bacteria, including Streptococcus pneumoniae, which damages red blood cells in order to release uh, hemoglobin from it, which is used by bacteria as nutrient, as, as food. Nemolysin is another toxin that creates uh, holes in host cells, again, to release their contents, which again is used by bacteria as food. Hydrogen peroxide is another toxin that is released by Streptococcus pneumoniae that damages the surrounding tissue. Now, what macrophages do in this case, they release cytokines. Cytokine is uh, a protein uh, which is released by, by macrophages in order to signal the body to ask for more help. Inflammation means uh, tiny blood vessels in and around infected area become dilated and become more permeable and now allow plasma proteins to move into affected area. Neutrophils are deployed, uh, which start phagocytosis again. Alveoli uh, get filled with exudates and exudates are composed of dead cells, neutrophils, fibrin, lysed uh, blood, uh, especially lysed uh, RBCs, broken down RBCs. Uh, it is this lysed blood which gives brownish color to the sputum of infected person. Fibrin comes uh, from fibrinogen which is um, a blood plasma uh, protein and is a part of healing process. Phagocytosis by neutrophils and if neutrophils uh, manage to finish the, the bacterial population then more macrophages are deployed and towards the end of the process fibrin lysis begin means fibrin starts uh, to break down uh, to be absorbed by the interstitial tissue or the lung tissue and then finally uh, lung uh, assumes or resumes uh, normal function.